For smooth registration, it's important that you prepare before you start. This second series of tutorial videos takes you through the steps you'll perform in Aurora as you prepare for registration. First, let's review some important things to know and remember as you choose your courses. There are a lot of things to consider as you prepare. Some questions to ask yourself include, what are my program and graduation requirements? What rules apply to me? Do I register using Aurora or in person? And what courses should I take? As a U of M student, it's your responsibility to be aware of your program requirements and of the rules that apply to you. By registering for courses, you agree to the rules and regulations of the University of Manitoba. These details are all found in the online academic calendar. This is your tool to understand your program of study and to keep track of your progress. It also contains subject-based lists of U of M courses and course descriptions. The online academic calendar is accessible from the U of M homepage or by going directly to umanitoba.ca slash calendar. Other resources are available to assist you in selecting courses suitable for your current or intended program of study. These include the First Year Planning Guide, the Summer Session Guide, and the Distance and Online Education Guide. The U1 First Year Planning Guide contains resources to help you learn about planning, course loads, and time management. For information on career planning and program exploration, access the resources from Career Services. If, after reviewing the academic calendar and the first year planning guide, you have any questions about what courses to take, you're encouraged to speak to an academic advisor. A complete listing of contact information for academic advisors for each faculty is available on the Registrar's Office registration website. Once you're comfortable with your program requirements, it's time to plan your schedule and create your timetable and obtain any permission you may need to register for your classes. Take special care to ensure that each time you register, the courses you choose meet the requirements for admission or graduation, that you've satisfied the prerequisite conditions of the courses you choose, and that the courses you choose are not mutually exclusive with or the equivalent of other courses you've already taken. It's also important to be aware of the details found in the course descriptions and in the class schedule. Knowing these details before registering for courses will reduce your chances of getting registration errors. These details might include, but aren't limited to, registration restrictions, course pre and co-requisite requirements, if the course needs to be taken with a lab or tutorial, whether there is a field trip for which extra fees will be charged, or if any special permission is required to take the course. In addition to the online academic calendar, the course catalog in Aurora may also be used to review descriptions of all courses offered by the U of M. The online academic calendar and the course catalog don't include schedule information, and so it's important to remember that the courses listed here are not offered every term or every year. To search the schedule of classes that are being offered in a specific term and to view section-specific details and restrictions, refer to the Aurora class schedule. The following tutorials will take you through looking up class schedule and course description information using Aurora and understanding your search results.